Little girls can be cute. Some, however, can be strange, creepy, or just downright scary. Howdy folks, I'm Score, the Crimson Renegade, bringing you my first countdown list. Here are five creepy little girls in video games. The list is short, so no rules here such as one entry per game or per franchise. It's not really needed. Number five. Lumina, Lightning Returns, Final Fantasy XIII. Strongly resembling Lightning's little sister, Sarah, Lumina is creepy in the fact that she can stand among the chaos that seems to destroy everything it touches, and yet she is completely unharmed. In some ways, it almost follows her around. While not the creepiest girl on the list, for those who have played Lightning Returns, the story behind Lumina only gets more uncomfortable, especially for the story's protagonist. Number 4. Farrah, Mortal Kombat 10. Farrah is a symbiote, a special kind of character created for Mortal Kombat 10. In MKX, symbiotes are two people bonded together and coexist very closely, usually because their strengths compensate for the other's weaknesses. In this case, Farrah is a diminutive girl that is not physically strong, but is intelligent, at least compared to her symbiote companion Tor. I believe Farrah's biggest creepy factor is that she's from Outworld, and the people there aren't really that normal to begin with. Number 3. Little Sisters from Bioshocks 1 and 2. With the exception of Eleanor in Bioshock 2, there really wasn't one specific little sister I could bring up for this entry. So, the entry here is a bit more general and goes to the barefooted, needle-carrying, distorted-voiced, atom-extracting little sisters of Bioshocks 1 and 2. In a way, these little girls are a bit like Farrah in that they mostly hang around the giant diving suit golems known as Big Daddies. However, their creepy factor is higher in that, despite their condition, they still sound and act like sweet, innocent little girls. Number 2. Evelyn, Resident Evil 7. Okay, the scary factor of this list just spiked, and making this list just made me uncomfortable. Anyway, Evelyn in her original form, I guess you could say, is a 10-year-old girl in a black dress with black rubber boots. This may sound innocent and normal, but when you learn that she can control fungal mold with her mind, infecting, controlling, and or killing people at her very whim, she's not quite so sweet anymore. She becomes obsessed with wanting a family of her own, and eventually finds the bakers who she comes to control. Created apparently as a bioweapon, Evelyn is one weapon that appears innocuous until it's too late. Number 1. Alma, the Fear Series. While Evelyn can control fungal mold and use it to create monsters and control people, Alma could be considered perhaps a distant cousin. Alma is a genetically altered child with extremely potent psychic abilities. Usually only seen as an illusion, the little Alma commonly is a warning to the player that something really bad is about to happen, whether she is the cause of it or not. That little red dress is a signal to either run or bend over and kiss your ass goodbye. I consider her the first lady of creepy little girls. I just thought of something. Who would win a fight between Alma and Evelyn? Either way, that part of the world would be uninhabitable for a very long time. Remember, this is a subjective list. These entries are my opinion and consist of characters and or games that I have played or have experienced with. I hope you've enjoyed this entry of the top 5 creepy little girls in video games. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and thanks so much for watching. I'm Score, the Crimson Renegade, and I'll see you later.